Sagan. Hey, what's up, guys? Today I'll show you the review of CM14.1 or Android Nugget. And it's a 7.1 Android, and I'm using this in my Redmi Note 3 device. So, let me show you my set settings. And you can see that this is Redmi Note 3 device, and I'm using the Android N version. So, it's Android N. Now, let's find out is there any bug in this ROM or not so let's start with the status bar so you can see guys uh, the Wi-Fi is working fine and I'm downloading the application Dead Trigger 2 and uh, the dual sim networks are working fine too and I use some data with this dual sim and Geo is also working fine I can call with Geo 4G and the battery is also working fine uh, I got around 8 hours battery backup with gaming since last day and the do not disturb is also working fine there is no bugs flashlight is also working fine and rotation also bluetooth is also working fine and aeroplane mode also working fine locations and everything else is working fine the status bar so there is no bug in the status bar uh, applications and now let's go to the settings and let's check out the display so the brightness level and everything else is working fine live display is also working fine rotation settings I don't want to change sleep is also working fine screen saver Expa expanded desktop so let's check out this and yeah it's working fine and I don't like this expanded desktop I'll just switch it off and ambient display all these things are working fine I will show you it now let's lock the screen and if I move my hand from the sensor you can see this right I can see the live display so it's working fine font size also working display size also working I can change the display size and the font size too without any problem there are no full to still now and everything is working fine in the display sound quality let's check out the sound quality there isn't any distortion in the sound quality I thought there will be distortion but it's working really good and the sound is really loud that's good thing about this ROM till now we don't have any noticed any bugs so let's head towards the storage I only have the internal storage because I am using dual sim I cannot use the memory card right now so, but memory card was working fine with this ROM there wasn't any problem battery it's good and yes buttons I can change all the buttons with this and wake up device and control volume ringtone volume everything is working fine with in the buttons yeah in security I'll show the fingerprint let's add a fingerprint and yeah it's working fine you can see I can set my fingerprint again and it's working fine without any bugs and it didn't force close that means it's working nice and now let me show you the status bar yeah in this clock style status bar icons AM PM style battery status style this is the bug I have found in this ROM and if I going if I try to change the icon to portrait it doesn't change you can see here right it doesn't change and if I try to change the icon to landscape it's still like this and the circle is the same it doesn't change that means the icon style is the bug and we cannot change the icon style but you can change it to text or you can hide it these two things are working and all the three are not working so the person is also working fine I can set in it inside or hidden or next to the icon quick pull down is also working fine 
you can see and show whether everything else is working and brightness control is also working fine so it's working there are no bugs and double tap to sleep is also working so you can see so guys in the settings menu there are no bugs we have found and just the uh, battery icon bug I think that's a minor bug don't worry about it and let's head towards the camera application in camera application there was a bug uh, when I was trying to open the camera application the it said that uh, camera isn't working fine and I just tried two to three times and it worked so I think there is a bug in the camera application because earlier I was uh, recording the screen and uh, I was trying to use the camera application it didn't open so I think there is a bug in the camera application but right now it's working fine I don't see any bugs I can use all these things slow motion and everything and I can click pictures so it's working fine but the quality is a little bit uh, dull in this camera application I think the MIWAC app was good for the camera and everything else is working fine let me show you the video uh, player in this phone because in CM14 the video player was not working good so let me show the video right now I don't have any video so but it's worked fine because I have tested the video player, stock video player, or you can use the MX player. And everything else is working fine. There is no bugs in this ROM, and you can see the multi window. Multi window is also working fine. And camera doesn't support, okay. Okay, so you can see, guys, I am using the multi window right now and there isn't any force close so it's working fine without any problem so that's it for this video guys and uh, thank you guys for watching my video if you like this video subscribe my channel and watch my other videos too